Many years ago, I was a football fan. As a football fan, one day I was going to watch football, and God told me, Your past year is over. Watching football is not a sin, but I was engaging the world. Now the world wants to engage me. The kind of ministry I've given you, you can't combine it with football. That is enlargement. The reason out of the many million young ministers, I was the one invited is because I obeyed that word. You are a man. There's a level you can never get to until you obey the word. I disobeyed for six months. When it's Saturday, my whole body begins to itch. I will stand up and say I want to buy something and throw and pass where they are watching football. And I'll say, okay, let me just check the score. Enter to check the score line, and then ah, what is this striker doing? I will now sit down and sit down till match is over. And every time match is over, my conscience will begin to fight me. You have disobeyed again, you have disobeyed again, you have disobeyed until I started begging God to help me. And when God started helping me, even when I go into the match, as I sit down, I doze off now. I now knew that my path was over. It was in that obedience that a new road was created. That was when I began to sense the pathway of the apostolic ministry. That was when I began to read the scrolls of Zion. That is when I began to see the things that were written concerning me before the foundations of the world. He told Jeremiah, before you were formed in your mother's womb, I know you. I knew you. You didn't come after you were born. You existed before you were born. When you were an intangible seed of eternity, that was when I started doing business with you. But I needed you to recognize me in time for me to work with you. He said, I ordained you to be a prophet. The word ordination means an established pathway. And for you. Hey guys. So this is an update. I started kind of a vlog this morning. I just got back from church. Today is Monday, and every Monday we, I we have women meeting in church. And um, I'm the women president, so I have to go. So I just go back. We're coming back from church, and we did a quick stop at. Um, what is it called? Market Square. See, I want to say something. My kids, like every other kid out there, we buy this hot chocolate, and you guys know how expensive these things are. And we buy it, and at the end of the day, it does not last. They make hot chocolate, I don't know how they make it. Like I've said, I'm going to sit up this, these days. I'm going to try as much as possible to take my responsibility seriously more because these children are making me look irresponsible because I don't get the reason why you buy let me show you because so I don't think I'm just here to blab like I said today is Monday we got this in on Saturday and this is um, 450 grams we got three of this so Destiny turned one into the container and the custard container where they, where they turn it and then Daniela came that same Saturday night and turned another one so we are left with this one and I'm like why? I'm looking at it, it doesn't look like two is inside what is going on? so I'm, I was very very angry with them and I decided that they are not going to drink this thing anymore at least not anytime soon so I went shopping for them, for my lovely children. You guys should see what I bought. So you guys should see what I bought. Tada! I bought them packs of Lipton. So from now onwards, they're going to be having Lipton. They don't like my top tea. So I brought them sweet Lipton. Hopefully they're going, of course, what is hopefully? They're going to take it. So I just got Lipton and then and then this is our let me not say mine because me I don't drink evaporated milk this is my husband and my children's new sweet tooth so this is what they take now uh, Hollandia Eva because it's full cream these people have sweet tooth the sweet tooth I'm dealing with in this house is just so it's just so I don't understand
like three crown. Destiny will tell you, <laughs> it doesn't taste like her. Um, Nunu, <laughs> it doesn't taste like her. Um, Cowbell, <laughs> it doesn't taste. I don't understand. Is this one that they want to take? This this people. My husband just scattered this children with his little. Bluetooth. Did you last check your marital status? I think it's six months ago. Six months ago? Yes, please. What was your marital status? I'm negative. With <laughs> 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 the sweet tooth, sir. So whenever we go to supermarket, he will always pick um, this uh, this thing. So my Nunu and my cowbell, just sitting down here pretty, waiting for me when I will drink it. And um, truth be told, I don't do more of milk, so... I've told you guys I'm lactose intolerant, so yeah, it just See, that so I've not used it. Duh, like tomorrow morning. Duh. So guys, I just said to give you guys an update. So it's late as you can see. I'm sweating. There's no fun. I need to just put these things away and then and then go and pour water and shower. And it will be time to go to bed. How are you guys doing? How are you guys doing? So we hit a milestone on YouTube. Thank you guys so much for all of you watching my videos, liking it, sharing it. I appreciate all of you so very much. Was it up to And we bought plantain also. <laughs> Can you guys guess how much this plantain is? Let's wow. film it very well. A million naira. Uh, why did you buy the plantain? The, the plantain meat is very very big. Meat. So we um this is uh, we got it for five thousand five hundred. This one five five. Yeah. So hopefully it will not just ripe one day on me <laughs> it's not ripe one day on me so hopefully it takes time to ripe so we we'll just uh we eat it as as it goes so that is it guys ah this egg is very dirty oh. like it has all this all this egg food so you guys I don't know if you've um, seen the video like I saw a video of this artificial egg factory I don't know what they're using to make egg with two yolks inside and they are packaging it as egg God should deliver us it's important that before when you buy things like this or anything you're using just continue to plead the blood of Jesus because it looks so real that you might not know that like you go to the market and you buy you know how they did it it looks like this easter bunny egg that we have, have the egg yolk i don't know what they use in making the egg yolk and they have the yolk the egg white i mean and they have the yolk and then the shell and they package it and it's egg i don't know how they do it but may god continue to deliver us so we got eggs we got eggs and then um, i remember one one revelation about food scarcity is on my channel that I saw you know we all need to be careful if you have opportunity to grow your own food if you have the capacity the space to kind of grow your own food please do it because it's the grace of God that we need you don't know what you're eating so whenever you buy anything in the market always plead the blood if you're a child of God plead the blood of Jesus cover your family because you know it is yes, right now we are asking God for for mercy and to see us through. It was in that obedience that a new road was created. That was when I began to change the pathway of the beginning and ending of this vlog. I hope you guys will enjoy it. I know you guys are going to enjoy it. So stay tuned. He told Jeremiah, before you were formed in your mother's womb, I know you. I knew you. You didn't come after you were born. You existed before you were born. When you were an intangible seed of eternity, that was when I started doing business with you. But I needed you to recognize me in time for me to walk with you. He said, I ordained you to be a prophet. The word ordination means an established pathway 
and for you to walk in that path, only obedience can take you there. And so anybody who wants to be enlarged, anybody who wants to be mighty in God, and when God started helping me, even when I go into the mass, as I sit down, I doze off. I now knew that my path was over. It was in that obedience that a new road was created. That was when I began to send... Good morning! Morning! Good morning! Oh, and in case I don't see you, good afternoon, good evening, and good night. Ha, ha, ha.